We're making a sexy video. Naying and walking out of the water. <laughs> oh my god, it's gone. I think he's pissed off now. Jesus. Sugar, honey, iced tea. You know you the shit. Looking like your mom. Back in 96. Girl, you got it. about this flight because it's an 11 hour flight to Bangkok and then another one and a half hour to Phuket but these 11 hours will be very fun because I brought something with me my sex in the city shoebox oh my god oh my god sex in the city shoebox and my portable DVD player which I'm gonna connect to my laptop this was one of the first presents that Maurits bought me a long ago. Okay. Uh, probably around 11 years ago? 10 years. Th 10 years. Ten ago. Year, I think 10 years ago, yeah. So, still thankful for it. right in front of our house I'm so scared of snakes and he's trying to kill it's either a bird or a frog or Maurit says a bat but I don't know I think he's now trying to eat it so scary it's so sad oh my god it's gone this is literally two minutes later maybe he survived I think he's pissed off now. Jesus. Uh oh, he's looking at us. He's shaking his head. Hi guys, we're in Phuket right now. We just got into our room. Actually, it's kind of like a house. Let me show you. It's very, very cute. And then I quickly want to show you how it looks from the inside. You really have to close the doors very well because of the mosquitoes. There are like hundreds of mosquitoes. Okay, so I set up this place for my makeup. And then you have a little lounge space over here. Then you go this way for the bedroom while this is working. Then we have this area over here. And then there's the bathtub right here. Cute. Shower here. This is Maurice's side, and then this is my side. I put all my bags, sunglasses, and accessories here. Here are all my beauty stuff. This is what I'm wearing. I really love this top, guys. It's from LPA, from Revolve. These shorts are from Girlfriend Denim. And I really like the zipper detail here. Um, this is how I did my hair and makeup. Then we go to my walk-in closet, which is huge. Um, so here are some clothes. There are some shoes over here. And then some more clothes right here. And then it goes all the way here, which is pretty crazy. We're gonna be here for for a week and I'm really really excited because it's so beautiful we're gonna do both days and just go to all sorts of beautiful places I'm really excited to bring you guys with me on this trip looking like your mom back in 96 girl you gotta kill let's see where Maurit is oh so nice out there are you tired already or not no I'm tired because we woke up at Three midnight because of jet lag, so this is going to be a long day. Hi! Hi. Yeah. Oh, that looks great. And then what do you put in it? Uh, you put on top of some taro, 
some young coconut, some mango, sesame seed. Wow. Yes. Can also, I try one? Yes, yeah. please. Mm. Yeah? Do you put milk in it or no? Coconut milk. Coconut. No, no dairy. No. Oh, it's that's good. Vegan. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Very good. Insurance situation. Uh -huh. <laughs> Okay, let's do it. Okay, this is all negative because I think this is useless, but she wants to turn off the light and then have just one flashlight. Doesn't make sense. But okay, you do anything for your girlfriend <laughs> to make her happy. <laughs> I should stand like this and then the mosquitoes, mosquitoes will come to the light. Yeah, that's the principle. Uh, this is so stupid. <laughs> this is so stupid. Marit, you don't say that to your girlfriend. Okay, Maurits's grandpa told Maurits that the mosquitoes are under the bed. Is that true or not? So we're gonna have a look. We killed a few ones and now we're just gonna use this all over our body. Let's see what's gonna happen. Good morning. It is 9.30 Sunday morning and we're waiting for the buggy to take us to the gym. I'm excited and tired. What about you? I already had a swim. So. You already had a swim. And uh, while we're waiting, we might as well do a little stretching. <laughs> Thank you so much. Uh, yes, the please. The gym. The reason why we're taking this buggy is because this place is so big and we don't know how to walk to the gym. It's not because we're lazy. Let me get that straight. I'm a little lazy. I'm not. This is the best view for a gym. It's so good. <laughs> One of my favorite workouts lately is rowing because I feel like you get a total body workout your legs, your butt, your abs and your arms and also my shoulders because I deal with a lot of shoulder pain so I love this I'm about to go to the beach and this is what I'm wearing this is a bikini set from Wave Swim it's actually it's the new swimwear line of Revolve by the way this video is not sponsored by Revolve even though we're here with them, <laughs> this video is not sponsored. These uh, shorts are from one times one teaspoon. Looks like this. Got a belly. How do you call this thing on? Actually, it's two necklaces tied to each other. And then this headband is from Gunny. Um, these earrings, I don't know. So yeah, this is the way I look. I'm gonna take a photo and enjoy the beach. If Maurits is ready, Yes, ready. Let's go. We're making a sexy video. <laughs> Negan walking out of the water. Negan, come on. You got a mosquito bite. Okay, yeah. show me your sexiest out of the water walk. Just kidding. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. take a photo by the way wow okay guys it's still cloudy we went to the beach we played volleyball etc and now we're going to a local market um, which i'm really excited to see there's supposed to be accessories and like food and everything so we'll see um this is what i'm wearing this is a kim k inspired look so this is like a set from lovers and friends um, mixed it with my Chloe backpack and this vintage vest. Belt bag. What did I say? Backpack. Oh, backpack. Thanks, Maurits. So, and then I'm wearing my Converse with them. That is 
the look this is my hair and makeup and um funny thing is when i was wearing it maori said to me no don't wear it did you or did you not it looks like a, no i like it but it looks like a, a spinning outfit like but a, you told me yeah. please don't wear this did you say when that you yes when or you no go, when you go cycling you know you look at my outfit i'm all like namaste He's completely zen on this trip. I'm zen. No, but it looks like, you know, someone who goes cycling, like a... Uh, turn around, turn around. Why do I have to turn around? Oh, that's nice. It's nice. You look beautiful. Oh. <laughs> I really like the outfit. I just really like the length of the shorts. <laughs> No, I just across. <laughs> this is not a look. <laughs> what do you think, Ben? I think I'd look good in those. Oh, well, they would fit you. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> so when we saw the snake, remember the other day, mm -hmm. and we didn't know what kind of animal he had. It was a frog. <laughs> oh, you make it sound all exciting. Do you want to meet Mosi? Made it to the boat. Good morning. This is my vegan breakfast together with Maurit. We brought our own oatmeal, so two oatmeals. And then we asked for hot water here and we're gonna put this in our bowl. And then I'm gonna put some almonds on there, brought them with me as well. We've got some fresh fruits, some mashed avocado, two apples, I'm bringing one with me this afternoon. A banana that I'm gonna put on top of my oatmeal and here is a vegan protein shake. So, I love, love, love these breakfasts. Mm good. I preferably put coconut or almond milk in my oatmeal, but hot water is also a good option. By the way, I feel like I should have mentioned that we just worked out, so that's why I got the protein shake. Okay guys, we are at the um, elephant sanctuary. It's so beautiful because there are a lot of elephants here. So I'm really happy we can get to see the elephants and also in a good situation. They're actually living their life here as it's supposed to be. We're so excited to meet the elephants. Oh wow, so beautiful. Such beautiful elephants, such beautiful animals in general. So I just wanted to repeat one more time while we're here. So this is a home for elephants that are either injured, sick or old. So that's really, really, really beautiful. We just saw a um, 15 minutes video about how elephants are treated in uh, Phuket or in Thailand and I think all over the world. I'm really shocked. I knew the situation was bad, but I didn't know it was this bad. And so I think it's good for you guys to know how the situation is. Maybe we'll look at the website of the Elephant Sanctuary here in Phuket. They're the first ethical ones. And I feel like if we support this, more elephants can come here and live the life they deserve. So educate yourselves about that, guys, because it's important. And I feel like the older I get, the more you become aware of Yeah of how people treat animals animals we're now gonna visit some uh, some elephants um, yeah, here in the sanctuary and they're all elephants have all worked in the tourism industry yeah. and are now retired so they don't have to do anything here yeah it's basically just... they said like a five-star luxury hotel for them here and we are also not able to touch them because their number one priority is for them to have a good life so we're not gonna bother them the only thing we may do is give them food and that's it so that they can just like live their lives yes um, so and donate some money yeah for sure it was pretty impressive yeah hi darling she looked like a baby but she looked baby she is 55 years old oh you old he's eating huh unbelievable it's so nice <laughs> 
Uh, Jill, this is a bit of your diet. <laughs> it is. Wow. So everyone is cleaning their hands because they're gonna feed the elephants. Did you like it? How was, was it? Good morning. It is Wednesday today. Tomorrow is our last day and then we're going home. But a few things. First of all, my camera isn't working anymore. I blame him. But he says he didn't do anything. We will never know what happens. Um, so I'm filming with my phone right now. Second thing is everybody went to a beach club and we decided to skip because we had a lot of work to catch up on. So this is how our day looked. So far we or I had a massage this morning, Thai massage for the first time in my life. And honestly, it was the best massage I ever had. So I booked a massage for Maurice as well. He didn't want to, but I insisted because it's so, so good. I feel like I'm reborn in a way. We worked for a couple of hours and we had a lot to do for Gizu. And so now we are spending an hour at the beach before we're getting ready for tonight. OMG, my camera is working again. Finally, I was afraid that I had to start filming the rest of this trip with my phone. Anyway, it's now Wednesday night, 7.40. And I'm getting ready for a beach dinner. Maurits is at the massage at the same exact person I went to. Her name is Pim. So I'm really curious to see if he liked the massage just as much as I did. Or because sometimes when you create like high expectations, some people get disappointed. So I'm wondering if he's disappointed and that I set the expectation level too high or that he is really happy, just as happy as I am. So we're going to a beach barbecue and this is what I'm wearing. It's pretty out there. They said something about fancy dress barefoot so I'm barefoot with a sort of a fancy set this is a top from LPA I actually have this one in orange as well it's really such a nice staple and then this is a skirt from its NBD both from Revolve and I was actually already wearing this yesterday but then I sort of had the feeling that everybody was going to dress up very casually so I was so happy that I changed into other clothes and I don't know if you can hear but this is the same spot actually where the snake was the other day but it's raining so they just sent us a message that dinner is now pushed back until 9 so I have another 90 minutes uh, or so to I don't know something else I wanted to share this has been a really different sort of revolve trip for me and Maurice because usually when we go to a revolve trip we always have a few nights where we have these crazy parties um, I already shared something about it quickly on insta stories but my dad is sick so these past couple of weeks at home uh, were so tough that I decided to like be very healthy on this trip so I didn't really party or whatever and I actually feel really really good right now I've been I think it's a combination of eating vegan partying not so much sleeping enough i'm i have to be honest it's been really really nice by the way this is how i wore this yesterday i actually already took a photo okay so i changed into comfortable shorts and oh my god it's storming outside it's gonna be an interesting beach dinner i guess who's back and from one to ten honest eight and a half <laughs> <laughs> okay, was this the best massage you ever had? Yeah, because I never had a Thai massage and now there was also stretching, different positions. But why and not a 10? Uh, because I uh, wanted to have one and a half hours better than 60 minutes. No, because they couldn't finish like the way mm. what she's supposed to want to do. Mm. <laughs> I feel like you just want to yeah, give eight and a half. Oh. Five, 50 minutes left. I Nah, I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> <laughs> I feel very weird. Why? Wearing these shoes and this look. But you look good. And I have a denim jacket. For me, just in case. Let's see if there's an animal standing in front of the door. Oh, 
<laughs> Kaka! That's romantic. Maurice is one lucky guy tonight, sitting in the middle. Yeah, two brunettes. <laughs> two brunettes. <laughs> Bye, Gil. Bye. See you tomorrow. Please work. Oh, finally. Oh, I was struggling again with my camera. So hopefully it's working right now. We're on our way to our yacht for our last day. Do I have what? Um, but it's raining on our last day. Um, this is what I'm wearing, by the way. It's starting to rain even harder. Jill, are we working out after? Yes. Jill's gonna train us after. Yeah, so we're so she's training. Train at the beach. What, all of us? At the beach? Yeah. No, I mean, at the beach. <laughs> she wants to go at, at the beach. No, just Stop being lazy. No, not at the beach. Why at the beach? At the gym. <laughs> Baby, There's while we work out, we get a tan, we look good, and then we swim. You get a tan? Where's the sun? <laughs> and you can do squats in the sand? <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I'm looking forward to the, the, guys, the, the guys workout. The, on the beach. This is Jill, guys. Hi. Hi. You've seen him before in my uh, video. He just made a deal with. This guy because he basically wants to look like him and now we're back together. Jill is a personal trainer and he is thinking about creating Correct. I'll keep you posted if he's starting because about it looks up to Jill because he's He's been motivating me so much. And that guy is actually, this guy, is so inspirational. In a different way. And he actually really gave me the drive to like, do something. Yeah, he, he managed to talk to Jill about starting to make YouTube videos. Yeah, because you know why? He is, not only does he have the, he has the best body, but also the greatest personality. So, um, the only thing is you have to step out of your comfort zone and just create these videos because people want to know what you're doing, you know, and how you become so fit and how you become so energetic and you know positive in life right yeah. and at first i had the same right but when i was i don't know if you guys remember but when when we were making youtube videos i was so awkward in the beginning and i was in the background but now i feel more comfortable here she is looking into the camera okay so um my camera was freaking out anyway what i wanted to say is that we were supposed to work out but then we came home later than we planned. So it's now 8 at night and we're just way too tired to go work out because we still have to pack and we're leaving tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. So that's it for our Thailand trip. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much. And I will see you in my next video. Big kiss.